Hello everyone. Today, we are going to study the five basic sentence patterns. Let's first define sentence pattern. Sentence pattern is arrangement of words in a sentence. And there are five basic sentence patterns. The first one is SIV or subject plus intransitive verb. Subject is a person or thing that is being discussed or described in a sentence and it is a noun or a pronoun. While intransitive verb is a verb that doesn't require an object. Let's see the examples. They worked. In this sentence, the subject is they and the intransitive verb is worked. Viens dances gracefully. Viens is the subject. Dances is the intransitive verb. These sentences do not have an object. The next pattern is STVDO or subject plus transitive verb plus direct object. Transitive verb is a verb that requires an object or receiver of an action while direct object is the receiver of an action. Examples She likes coffee. In this sentence, the subject is she, the transitive verb is likes, and the direct object is coffee. Remember that direct object answers the question what or whom. For example, what she likes. The answer is coffee. Therefore, coffee is the direct object. Marian brought a book. The sentence follows the same pattern. Marian is the subject, brought is the transitive verb, and book is the direct object. What did Marian bring? A book. Therefore, it is the direct object. STVIODO or subject plus transitive verb plus indirect object plus direct object. Indirect object is a noun or a pronoun receiving the direct object. Let's see the examples. Kat made Marian a dress. In this sentence, the subject is cat, the transitive verb is made, indirect object is Marian, and direct object, address. Remember that indirect object is a noun or a pronoun receiving the direct object. For example, who received address? Marian. Indirect object answers the question to whom or for whom. For example, for whom was the dress made? For Marian. Therefore, Marian is the indirect object. He gave me flowers and chocolates. He, subject, gave, transitive verb, me, indirect object. Flowers and chocolates are direct objects. To whom were the flowers and chocolates given? To me. Therefore, me is the indirect object. STVDOOC or subject plus transitive verb plus direct object plus object complement. Object complement describes, renames, or gives information about the object and it can be an adjective or a noun. Examples I found the book interesting. The subject is I Transitive verb, found, direct object, book, and object complement, 
interesting. Object complement describes the direct object book. They chose Kenna, their leader. The sentence follows the same pattern. Their leader is the object complement and it gives information about the direct object to complete its meaning. The last pattern is SLBSC for subject plus linking verb plus subject complement. Linking verb links the subject in its complement, while subject complement describes or provides information about the subject, and it can be an adjective or a noun. Examples She is intelligent. She is the subject. Is is the linking verb. Intelligent is the subject complement. Subject complement describes the subject she. I am a teacher. I is the subject. Am is the linking verb. And teacher is the subject complement. And it provides information about the subject. Arnold looks happy. Arnold is the subject. Looks is the linking verb. Take note that sensory verbs such as sim, look, smell, appear, etc. can be linking verbs. Happy is the subject complement and it describes the subject Arnold.